Shari Kaufman. I'm a clay artist in this at the Columbia City Gallery. I do ceramics on the wall. And for this exhibit, Beyond Technique, I wanted to explore um, how I could push beyond my technique using a mold. I do a lot of um, my ceramics works. I'd like to repeat. Mul I'd like to do multiples and repeat a certain shape. And so. This whole exhibit that I've created here is based on this one shape that I, from this mold that I created, um, I made it out of clay and then poured the plaster, and then I use it as a press mold. And so this first piece is this piece on the wall, and you can see the different shapes, and I tweaked them a little bit, pulled and pushed the, the um, to get them to layer. So I just, um, I loved the effect of that. and. I'm using very minimal glaze, just wanted to highlight the, the, um, the valleys and the, the, um, the different places in that piece. So, when I completed the piece on the wall, then I wanted to turn my attention towards three-dimensional and to see how I could work with the pieces that are standing on pedestals, coming up, and then the, um, having the pods hanging. I had played with this idea a little bit before, um, and I have some of the pieces, I uh, have some of the pods hanging from some, a trellis at home. Um, so I, I wanted to explore that idea more and, um, and see how much I could do with that. So first I started with the basic shape. You can see um, when you look at these, here's that same shape that's coming off of that mold. And then the pieces here, I was able to really starting from the inside, really layer them until I got to a place where I felt like it was a really full display and then I got the clay to be able to set up in this position. And I'm using paper clay for this display, for this exhibit, um, which is much lighter, it's like 50% paper. And so when I was, because when I was looking at hanging these pieces, I, I needed to make sure that they wouldn't fall off the ceiling and make each piece as light as I could. So you can see that the, there's there's some different different styles here, and I have this vision of having the pods be closed and open. Because when I was creating this piece, I was um, it was right at the end of winter, starting to be spring, and, and so we had a very gray winter, and then we started to get just some of those early pops of color that were coming out. And I spend a lot of time I draw most of my inspiration from nature, and so as I was on my daily walks, I was able to. I was paying attention to how there was the color inside, so the, the outside of the pods and would be very monotone, very light colors, but then they would start to pop open and you could see the color inside. So I, I was mimicking that with these pods. Just bringing in the slightest bit of color on the outside using that green glaze and then for the pieces that were open, um, highlighted the color on the inside. And I had a lot of fun playing with the different um, ways that I could use that same, again, that same form. So everything from the closed form to um, more layers on the outside, opening up. The ones that are open in this way almost remind me of birds in flight, the way the, the top part of the pod looks. And figuring out how to hang this installation was really challenging because there's a lot of weight. I wanted it to be at eye level so that you felt like you were really looking at it, right, and you could see up into it as well. And the same kind of shapes coming from the top and the bottom. There's a relationship between the ones that are coming up from the pedestals and the ones that are hanging down. And I mimic the color and um, the shapes are the same so that to have, this, to have a conversation between the two. I'm Shari Kaufman and I'm a ceramic artist working in Seattle, Washington.